Good morning, everyone. We're going to the bookstore today. Happy Tuesday. Now, I know what you're thinking, obviously, because you guys know me so well. Why is Sunny going to the bookstore? Sunny doesn't buy books. I don't buy books for myself. That's very, very true. However, two of my friends are coming to come visit me this weekend, and it's my roommate's birthday this weekend. And if you don't know, gift giving is one of my love languages. And my plan is to go to the bookstore to try to buy books. I love book giving. And I'm bringing you guys, but you guys aren't charged. <laughs> so I have to bring all your luggage. Too, which is like spare batteries and stuff. See you when I'm headed to the bookstore. Can you talk about how it's literally the perfect fall day? Out. Canvas tote bag and me against the world. Making my way downtown. I'm homebound. No, I'm bookbound. Sorry guys, I'm getting so distracted. All the other random stuff that Indigo has. Okay, now let's actually go look for the books. Look at all these water bottles. Why am I such a sucker for water bottles? Oh my gosh, I just read that. Also, the last time that I vlogged myself in a bookstore, so many comments were like, oh, this is going too fast for me. Sorry. Oh my gosh, I really want to read this. I really, it's been recommended to me so many times. Oh my gosh, wait, it's so small. Why are the other ones I've seen so big? My camera's about to die. Okay, I just emergency changed your battery. That was the first time of me doing that in public, which was stressful, but a character builder. Actually, I wonder if I can find the book that I'm reading right now. It's by the same author, but I don't think it's here. I actually do really want to read the series. I'm reading Babel right now by the same author, and I really like it so far. If I end up loving it, loving it, then maybe I'll read this series, because I know this was like the very famous one. This is the SJM section. Not touching that. Okay, we must stay focused, brothers. I recognize this book. I'm pretty sure it's new and just came out. Oh. I tried reading this book, DNF'd it, maybe in another life. Oh, this is that really, um, of course I've seen this book around. I literally have never seen the physical copy though. This is like the most famous like thick fantasy book. Like people who finished this entire book deserve the Nobel Prize. I did not realize how chonky of a book this was. Oh my god, look at that. Guys, my hands are abhorrently big. They're that of a gargantuan's and look at it. That's crazy, bro. Okay, it's like a floppy paperback though. Maybe I couldn't murder someone, but I could definitely take one out. <gasps> There's literally the box set of this. Dark Shadow Magic series. The series that I'm in love with at the moment and I need to finish the last book. Oh my gosh, that's crazy. Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. And I'm sorry, I just keep... <laughs> I'm carrying this thermos and phone charger everywhere. I don't have anywhere to put this and I don't want people to think that I'm shoplifting and put it in my bag. I know what books I want to buy. I'll tell you what they are when I find them. Okay, let's go to the teen section. There were some girls there when I came here and so of course I avoided it. I think they're gone now. <gasps> Do you see that? It's the summer series. Okay, one of my books might be here. I was just sent this book by the publisher. I'm literally so excited to read it because it's literally by a Kim sister. So of course I'm going to. Oh my gosh, By the Night is here. I've never seen this book in person. You know, every time I go to a bookstore, I feel like how we all felt when we saw like our classmates in person for the first time after like just seeing them virtually for years. I'm like, oh wow, I've seen you. Like I've, I've just seen you like, Guys, the book that I'm looking for, the sequel is here, but the first book isn't. I want this book. So it's the last one. Okay, either order it online or I could try to see if one of my backup books are here to give to her. Although I really want to give her that one. The other books are not in this section. I need to go to the Taylor Jenkins Read section. Guys, this is my favorite. <gasps> Never seen the paperback of this. This is my favorite TJR book, guys. I'm so, <gasps> I don't think I understand. I'm literally so tempted. I love this book so much. Where's the TJR section? Oh, it's here. And by the way, her newest book, Carrie Soto. I have it. Not the physical copy, obviously. I have the ebook. It's next on my list. Guys, it's the beautiful 50th anniversary or 25th anniversary. 25th anniversary Indigo edition. They like republished a lot of these like really popular books and like these beautiful covers. My friend bought it. Oh my gosh, please. I had one mission. It's almost like the book market is not personalizing itself exactly to what I need. This random girl, which is so rude. They literally don't have, where is it? I'm looking for one true loves because I want to give it to two of my friends. Am I also going to have to order that online? I mean, I will. I can and I will. Will. They have her like other backlist. They have after I do, which is her only backlist that I haven't read yet. What even is it about? Is this what Taylor Jenkins Reid looks like? She's so pretty. She looks like that. She looks like that girl from the second Pitch Perfect movie, the singer from Germany. They don't have it. Maybe they have it in one of those little random piles along the shelf. If someone can convince me to read the fine print and the terms and conditions series by Lauren Asher and like make me love it, I will give you all my children. We're right at the romance section. I mean, I feel like I'm kind of getting out of my like romance season because I'm not gonna talk about it here. I'll probably talk about it more in my wrap up, but I'm kind of getting over it a little bit. I mean, still 
obviously I love books, but I was really on a kick for a little bit. I feel like that kick, like I'm, I'm done. You're done. There hasn't really been much that's been catching my attention. I also read that book, cried my eyes out. So actually, if anyone has any good romance books they would like to recommend that are not by white authors, anyone knows I need would like to recommend any to me. I'm all ears because I need motivation to just enjoy life right now okay see now these books this is a book i can get behind i love this book so much and i forgot that the second book slash companion book came out this book i've seen everywhere if i should ask i considered reading it but i heard kind of mixed things about it but i do understand why people want to own it because this retro cover is just everything it's so cute Welcome to definitely being the same day. Um, yeah, I don't know what you're talking about. Okay, so let's just pretend that I bought these books at the bookstore and not from Jeff Bezos. Mini haul, but the haul is three books. Two of them are literally the same book. I will still explain books that I got and why I got them and everything like that. Okay, let me start out with the one book, Blood Boat Taipei by Abigail Hing Wen. I read this, was it last year? Maybe it was even two years ago. I, I explained this before, but I did not buy these books for myself. I bought these books to give to three of my friends. Friend number one, um, and the reason that I'm giving this book is because okay this is like not the best book i've ever read in my life obviously but this book has such a special place in my heart because the main character ever wong she had a really similar upbringing to me and it was like the first time that i ever really saw myself in a book character like that i don't know just so many of her specific experiences i'm like wow i've like experienced that exact same thing like oh my gosh like i've never seen myself so much in a book character before because me and this friend have talked a lot about like our upbringings and stuff and so when i give to books you already know. I write entire letters on the front about why I chose this book. I feel like it's like a good insight into like how I felt in my life. The next two books I got are the same book. One True Loves by Taylor Jenkins Reid. I've never seen this cover before. I think this is like the British cover. Um, These ones aren't, aren't floppy paperbacks though. So for my two other friends, I got them the same book because I have like been wanting them to read it forever and I was just waiting for the perfect opportunity. Perfect, perfect, perfect to give them. These are actually the two friends that I also made read The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo by Taylor Jenkins Reid and they both loved it literally done. I forced them both to read it and now I'm really spreading the TJR agenda again because it's one of my other favorites, One True Love. Duh. Wrote an entire letter on the front. Same with the other one. This one too, I didn't get a chance to annotate all of it but I did go through and like highlight some of my favorite like standout parts or like the parts where like the parts that like really resonated with me. I did the same thing with One True Loves. I went through and I just highlighted all of my favorite quotes and lucky for me is that I have a record of all my favorite quotes because I book journal and also I have it on my e-reader. I've definitely talked about One True Loves before because it's one of my favorite books that I've read this year. It talks a lot about love and loss. You know, how can you love again after you've lost, you know, how do you move on from a true love like those kind of questions and so I just really wanted both my friends to read it the second that I read this book I was like I I want them to read it anyway that's the haul the haul is just three books that I'm giving away to people um but I hope you enjoyed this video thanks so much for watching come to the bookstore with me it's a time what a time what a time be sure to subscribe down below if you haven't already follow me on all my socials they're all linked in the description and I'll see you all in the next one goodbye <laughs>